Hello guys and welcome slash welcome back to my YouTube channel. Anyways, today's video is going to be how to do a heart braided hairstyle for Valentine's Day or for fun. So anyways, what you're going to need is a hairbrush, um, some bobby pins, and maybe some of these little hair ties. So what you're going to do is you're going to start by brushing out all the hair, making sure it's good and brushed. Then you're going to want to like, section it into like some of it into two sections. So make it like two sections. And what you're going to do is you're going to grab about this much hair, about an inch thick, and then you're just going to start braiding. So we're just going to go ahead and split this into three sections. Try to get it as even as possible, and then you're just going to braid that down the head. As good as you can get it. And just keep braiding the hair to get it all the way down to the ends. Just keep going with it. And if you don't know how to braid, um, what you're gonna do is just pull one from each side into the middle. So like this, and go to the middle, and then do that all the way till you get to the bottom of the hair, or where you want to end it off at. So you just want to keep doing that. You can also add a hair tinsel or some like spray hair dye at pink. So then now you're going to take your little hair tie that you can use, but it probably will help if you use a little hair tie at the end, and then you're just going to tie it in the hair at the end of where you want the end of the braid to be. You can also put red hair tinsel in the hair where you want the heart or just wherever. And you can also add like a bret, so you might want a bret or something. So now you got that braid, what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and take it like so. Then you're just going to take, so for, it goes from here, then you're going to take it and turn, go the opposite way of the braid. So like, like so. And then now we're going to grab our bobby pins. And we're going to pin, just add pins. And try to make it so you don't see the bobby pins as greatly as you can. And just kind of pin it to where you can tuck in the bobby pins as greatly as you can get them. And just kind of tuck them in. Yeah, I know it kind of looks a little bit messy because there's some hair tinsel. That's different colors. Um, yeah, you could just use, a, you could do like red and pink hair tinsel or use some like red hair color or hair dye or whatever. And this turns out good. So now what you're going to do is you're going to take it and braid the other side as well. You want to try to give it as even as a section as possible. We're just going to pretty much repeat on what we did on the other side. And then you're going to braid it. And you're just going to braid it all the way down. So you're going to go. So you're just going to braid and pull to the middle. All the way down. And just keep doing that. Until you get to the bottom. There's some hair tinsel in the hair from my um, hair tinsel video. And there's some hair tinsel in this. Comment if I should put some hair tinsel in my hair down below. Or if you would do this hair for Valentine's Day. Comment if you like this hairstyle for Valentine's Day. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe as well. Now we're going to put the hair tie on the end of this. You can braid a little bit more if you want, but they're just going to add a hair tie now. And you probably, you might be able to get away without doing the hair ties and just doing the bobby pins. But just kind of depends on how you want it. So you're just going to braid that. And now we're going to do the same thing. But instead of going that way, we're going to do the opposite way. And then we're just going to take that over. You might have to kind of adjust where you want it. And you might have to redo it couple times before you get it, it where you want it and then add the bobby pins and then I'm gonna redo the other side of the twist thing because I need to redo it it will look better if I redo it I think real quick I'm not gonna redo the braid but I'm just gonna redo the twist on this side just so we get a better one okay so that's what we want oh so if it, you twist the braid and then you twist it like so okay so there, that looks better. You can play with it and adjust how you want the braid to go. Trust me, you're going to have to play with it. 
So then you should have like two little like knot looking things. Then what you can do after that is now you're just going to take these little leftover ends and if you still have some leftover ends what you're going to want to do is you're going to take it and put them into three sections. You can braid it as best as you can if you want and make sure that doesn't fall down so we need another bobby pin because that fell down wherever the bobby pin went fell down so you want to make sure you got it pinned good because otherwise it will fall down and I did not get that one pinned sorry so you see what I mean you want to make sure you got it pinned get some hair and now it is pinned better now you can you can leave it like that and have a little like heart as you can see or so you can do that and then you have a little heart that's supposed to be more like that and then you have like a little heart like that or what you can do after that is you can braid it at the ends so now we're just going to take it and we're just going to add the braid at the ends and then we'll see how this looks hold on a second make sure the pins stay in there so this one keeps moving okay sorry about that now we're just gonna braid the ends because see the hair tinsel makes it a little bit funner you can just braid the ends and you can always adjust the heart shapes at the end if you want you can just kind of braid the ends if you want if you have some stuff to braid they can add a little hair tie in the ends the best of your ability and then if you need to still adjust the heart shape you can still do that so we're just going to kind of adjust the heart shape to get it to the best that we can okay so hopefully you can kind of see the little heart so there's a heart there and then what you can do after you have the braid on the bottom you can do a better braid than I did this is more to show you to add that and then look you have a little heart isn't it cute yeah See, there's a little heart. Looks so cute. Okay, anyways, thank you for watching. Um, let me know if you try out this hairstyle. Hopefully you guys like it. Here, let me get you guys a better view of it. Maybe here, I'll just lift this up. So, one second, sorry. Let's focus it better. So, anyways, hopefully that's a better view for you guys. And hopefully you guys really like how it turned out. And it looks really cute. Um, also, I have another heart hairstyle on my youtube channel if you want to see how that looks so you can also kind of just adjust how you want the heart like if you want to make the braids a little looser you can make them braids a little looser for the heart so anyways thank you guys so so much for watching hopefully this video is not too too long um yeah anyways happy valentine's day thank you for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed this um hairstyle um and let me know if you tried it out um don't forget to like and subscribe um happy valentine's day and thanks for watching see y'all and if you're a trans subscriber thank you so much